Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Halo students, how are you today? I hope you are fine Kembali lagi kita bertemu di channel ini Channel yang membahas materi-materi pembelajaran bahasa Inggris Matematika IPA dan Biologi Kali ini kita akan membahas materi Things in the Kitchen Untuk SMP kelas 7 Bagi kalian yang baru bergabung Jangan lupa untuk subscribe channelnya Like video-videonya Dan share selalu ke temannya Agar kita bisa belajar bersama dari mana aja Hello friends, my name is Diane. Welcome to my kitchen. This is the place where I cook my meals. There are many tools and stuffs here. You can observe carefully. Can you help me to mention the tools and their functions? I bet you can. Let's start. I want you to prepare a piece of paper and a pen. With your group write the tools and their functions. After that, you can share it with other groups. Have a nice lessons. Oke kita sekarang berada di dapurnya Dayen dan tadi Dayen sudah menjelaskan bahwa kita diminta untuk memperhatikan benda-benda yang ada di sini di dapur ini dan kita diminta untuk menuliskan benda-benda tersebut beserta fungsinya kalian bisa menyumanya dengan menggunakan kamus jadi kalian perhatikan benda-benda ada yang, yang ada di dapur ini kemudian kalian catat nama benda tersebut dalam bahasa Inggris beserta fungsinya masing-masing oke jika kalian sudah mengerjakannya yuk kita saksikan penjelasan mengenai benda-benda tersebut this is a refrigerator a fridge is used to keep the food cold and in a good temperature this is a refrigerator a fridge is used to keep the food cold and in a good temperature this is a cooker hood a cooker hood is designed to remove odors, smoke, grease and other pollutants that are released into the air while cooking. This is a cooker hood. A cooker hood is designed to remove odors, smoke, grease and other pollutants that are released into the air while cooking. This is cabinet. Cabinets are used to store food and cooking utensils. This is cabinet. Cabinets are used to store food and cooking utensils. This is a frying pan. A frying pan is used for frying, searing, and browning foods. This is a frying pan. A frying pan is used for frying, searing, and browning foods. This is a teapot. A teapot is used to boil tea leaves and then pour it into the teacup. This is a teapot. A teapot is used to boil tea leaves and then pour it into the teacup. This is a spoon. A spoon is used for eating, serving, and cooking foods. This is a spoon. A spoon is used for eating, serving, and cooking foods. This is a spatula. A spatula is a kitchen utensil you can use to mix, scrape, flip, or spread ingredients. This is a spatula. A spatula is a kitchen utensil you can use to mix, scrape, flip, or spread ingredients. This is an egg whisker. An egg whisker is used for mixing eggs. This is an egg whisker. An egg whisker is used for mixing eggs. This is a plate. A plate is used to hold food. This is a plate. A plate is used to hold food. This is a stove. A stove is an appliance used to cook by providing heat directly. This is a stove. A stove is an appliance used to cook by providing heat directly. This is a chopping board. A chopping board is a kitchen utensil used as a protective surface on which to cut or slice things. This is a chopping board. A chopping board is a kitchen utensil used as a protective surface on which to cut or slice things. This is a kitchen glove. Kitchen glove is a barrier between ready-to-eat food and bare skin contact. This is a kitchen glove. Kitchen glove is a barrier between ready-to-eat food and bare skin contact. This is a teacup. A teacup is a cup for drinking tea. This is a teacup. A teacup is a cup for drinking tea. This is a fork. A fork is used for cooking, serving, and eating food. This is a fork. A fork is used for cooking, serving, and eating food. This is an oven. An oven is used for baking food, like baking muffins. This is an oven. An oven is used for baking food, like baking muffins. This is a sink. A sink can be used for washing hands, dishwashing, and other purposes. This is a sink. A sink can be used for washing hands, dishwashing, and other purposes. Hello friends, 
I am Ivy. Now, I am here in my kitchen. I want to make something. Can you help me to decide which utilities should I use? I want to make some coffee. What kitchen utilities do you think should I use? A. A keto. B. A pot. I want to make an omelette. What tools do you think should I use? A frying pan. A kitchen gloves. I want to cut some fruits. Which utilities should I use? A spoon. A knife. Baik, kita sudah sampai di akhir pembelajaran. Jangan lupa untuk mengulang kembali pembelajarannya di rumah. Sampai bertemu di pembelajaran berikutnya. Tetap sehat, tetap semangat, dan tetap belajar bersama Sigma Semastari karena belajar bisa dari mana aja.